vision is to promote a high-performing culture and climate that inspires our community of learners to achieve academic excellence. Our mission is to reach, to teach, and to equip, and you've got it, our theme for the year. I want everybody to maximize their potential. So let's all pause now so that we can recite our student creed. I am an OP elementary school student. I have great expectations for myself. I accept the challenge to become the best student that I can be. I am proud of my school. The vision of Oakview is to promote a high performing culture and climate to inspire our community of learners to achieve academic excellence. I accept the responsibility for my behavior and its results. I am determined to be safe, responsible, productive, and respectful. I have high expectations for myself and I will reach my full potential. I will choose to be great. So students, here we go. We're starting the second week of school and I am super duper excited. Couple things I want to remind you. Please remember the four B's as we start our second week of school. First B, be safe. Make sure you have on your mask. Make sure it's covering your mouth and your nose. I'm sure DJ Supercrunk will be playing that song for you very, very soon. We want to make sure that we keep all of our friends and our teachers safe as well as ourselves. So make sure you wear your mask every single day and make sure that it covers your mouth and your nose. Let's be responsible. Have all of your school supplies. Make sure you have everything that you need when you get out, out of the house in the morning so that you can be successful at school. Be productive. Make sure when you get to school, you're getting your work done. This week, we'll start our skills assessment. We'll also start our map testing really soon, and we want to make sure that everyone is putting their best foot forward and you're showing your teachers what you know and what you need additional support with. So make sure that you're being productive this week. And last but not least, of course, be respectful. Make sure that you're following the rules, the routines, and the protocols that your teachers have in place to not only keep you safe, but ensure that we have a positive learning environment in every classroom and across our school. Make sure you show your teachers how much you appreciate school reopening so that we can all stay together for the duration of the school year. That's all that I have. You all have a wonderful Monday, Oakview. Greetings, Oakview Strong. Thank you for having another mindful moment with favors. So we already established what mindfulness is. We know that it is paying attention on purpose, but not judging or overreacting to those things that we're paying attention to. Um, we also um, already established how long, when, where, and who we will practice mindfulness with. So today, your lesson is to know how to focus on your breath, okay? Uh, you can focus on your breath by noticing how your breath feels as it goes in and out of your nose, how fast the air is going in and out of your nose. You can also use your, your hand, put it on your stomach as an anchor and feel your breath go in and out of your belly. When you breathe in, your belly will go up. When you breathe out, your belly will go down like a balloon. So let's practice. Get into your mindful posture. Your mindful posture is uh, sitting with your back straight. Your feet are flat on the floor. Your hands are resting in your lap. Your eyes are closed. Now begin to focus on your breath. Allow your eyes to slowly open. Thank you. Have a great day, Oakview.